Hey guys, it's me. I'm sorry I didn't upload Sunday, so this video is going to kind of make up for it. Uh, this is low-key inspired by Tar Tara Yummy, so if you know who she is, go check out her video. But this video is a little different. Um, it's outfits inspired my, by my favorite time periods, so we're going to have the 90s, the 50s, the 70s, the 80s, and the 60s. So, enjoy this video. Alright, so the first outfit we have here is the 90s inspired outfit. I went more towards the grunge era because I thought it was really cool and really cute. So, that's why everything's gray and my eyes look very raccoonish. Alright, so you're going to see these boots uh, at least two more times because they go with my 50s and my 80s outfit, but I really like these for the 90s outfit with a little bit of cupping at the jeans. Alright, so this outfit is loosely based on Woodstock because of hot pants, crop tops, flowers, hippies, you know. So that's what I went with. You can't see it, but I also have a flower crown on. So for this outfit, since Woodstock was outside, I went ahead and went with some strappy wedges. I just thought they were really cute. Obviously not ideal for walking all day, but again, this is an inspired look. So there you go. This is my 70s schoolgirl look, I guess. I don't know, um, but the sweater always, ever since I got it, has always reminded me of that 70s show, so I paired it with the skirt. I didn't really have any 70s shoes, so I went ahead with some gray booties that were neutral gray shade to match the whole outfit. Um, I don't know, I just really thought it fit the outfit pretty well, so I went ahead and went with the, br the brown, the gray boots. All right, this is one of my favorite outfits that I have in this entire video. I took a lot of inspiration from the movie The Outsiders, which is one of my favorite movies on the planet and books. Um, I decided that jean, normal jeans with some rips in it would be cool and a jean jacket and just a normal black shirt because I wanted to go for more of a greaser look because, you know, if you know me, you know that that is what I like, so yeah. First of all, yes, I know my makeup is messed up. I was very hot and very sweaty and very tired, but please excuse the fact that my boot is unzipped. I didn't even notice, and same excuse, hot, sweaty, and tired. All right, last but not least, my 80s outfit. I went more towards the rocker style, and I went ahead and did the iconic blue and red lip look that was very popular in the 80s, and I decided to go with my bedazzled jeans because rock stars back then, at least back then, had a lot of blinged out clothes, and I had to reach for my sunglasses because I remember when, hey, it's the 80s, you know, Freddie Mercury wore these a lot. And that's what I'm listening to in this clip. That's why I started dancing and stuff. So enjoy. Last time you'll see these boots, I promise. Um, I really have no explanation. I'm just telling you that, hey, it goes with this outfit. So there you go. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. That was my outfits inspired by my favorite time periods. It got really hot and really sweaty, and I'm sorry that my makeup deteriorated until the end. So, again, thank you guys for watching. I'm so sorry I didn't post last Sunday. I thought I would make this video, which took forever to make, just for you guys to make up for it. Now I'm going to go put this amount of 80s hair, which is this look. I took the jacket off because it's really hot right now, uh, in a bun and edit this for you guys. And also make a thumbnail. I love you guys.